update for you now on a story we've been following. Minutes ago, we received new information about the death of a man outside Arrowhead Stadium Sunday night. Sayed Shabir is live with new details now from the medical examiner's report. Sayed. Yeah, good morning, Cynthia. We've just learned here in the last half an hour or so that the medical examiner is calling this suspicious death out at Arrowhead from Sunday a homicide. Up until now, detectives have just been calling it suspicious or a possible homicide, but now the medical examiner has ruled it a homicide. If you remember back, we've been reporting all week long about this suspicious death out at homicide out at Arrowhead. They found uh, Kyle Van Winkle uh, in lot A around 5 o'clock Sunday afternoon. He was in critical condition, rushed to the hospital where he later died. Now, if you remember, as we've said all week long, he was in a red Jeep Grand Cherokee, uh, a car that police say was very similar to the car that he arrived to the game in. Uh, when the owner of that Jeep Grand Cherokee returned to his vehicle, he saw Van Winkle in there and thought he was trying to steal from him. That's when police say there was some kind of fight or an altercation, and that's when Van Winkle was seriously injured. Now, police have been treating this as a possible homicide the entire time, so nothing will change in their effort. But now they are asking anyone who was in that parking lot that day, uh, who was in lot A around 5 o'clock, to come forward because they're trying to get with as many witnesses as they can to get as much information about what actually happened that Sunday afternoon. Reporting live, Sayed Shabir, 41 Action News.